What's up guys? This video is gonna be on Violet Jungle. I forgot to record earlier, but anyways, just to recap. I started red buff. Violet is very strong level 2 with red buff. And the enemy jungler is Li Xing, and he's off what jungler. So I just go and steal his blue buff and actually, if you watch the... Well, you can't see it, but he couldn't do anything. I just went up and took his blue buff. So yeah, so we are off to a good start. The reason why I'm doing this is because in three days, Violet Jungle won't be viable anymore, so rest in peace. And as you guys might have known, I used to one-trick this hero. Yeah, this is probably the last time I'm ever playing this hero. I haven't played this hero in like a month, but yeah. <clears throat> so I sit in this bush because Red Buff is going to spawn. And he's actually level 3.8 at this point, so yeah, yoink. Okay, so he gets that camp, so he's 4, but they don't know I'm doing this, and he doesn't realize, so I just take it. And go this way because it's safer, and we get a kill. <coughs> I'm not really playing that, like, try hard this game, but... Yeah, some people, some of you like playing ADC jungle. And remember I mentioned I had this blue buff before, so I'm gonna try to take it. I don't think it's gonna be, mm, I don't know. I still get it somehow, but I shouldn't have gotten it. Uh, here I just do dragon, no I don't. I should have done dragon, but yellow. Anyways. I see this fight breaks out, but I just take dragon anyway. I could have joined the fight, but the thing is, Chagna is such an annoying hero to deal with as an ADC. Like, I can't kill this Chagna. <coughs> Anyways, it's the power of two ADCs. Like, if you kite a bruiser, then she just instantly dies. So, I abuse that, and uh, that guy dies. Yina dies instantly. So, I'm just farming. At this point, I feel like... I don't really have a support and I don't feel like I can push my advantage that much so I'm just gonna farm. And you'll see that I don't play this very well mid late game but the idea is that if you have an advantage like I do right now then you should probably like fight and press the advantage but I feel like because I don't have a support and it's kind of low elo I'm probably going to have to wait to my uh, big item, which is the pink item. Here we get a kill because she has no idea I'm here. It's looking pretty good. This game lasts for so long because again, this is low elo. <coughs> so, like, you'll notice that I make some mistakes in this game. And I'm not playing that serious, but if you're looking to climb, you can afford the luxury. Like, I'm already high elo, so to me this is like a joke game, you know what I mean? Like, I can do dumb stuff. And like, even if I do dumb stuff, I have a good feeling that I can still kind of come back and win. But we are, <coughs> like, looking to climb stars, you have to have the mentality, and you have to feel like, you have to play well like the entire game, you know, you have to concentrate. I'm not gonna concentrate in a low elo game, but you guys, if you wanna win, you have to. You can't blame your teammate. Or you can't rely on them. Either. So here I'm just farming, like, without a support and two ADCs, the problem is we can't really get a push and we have bad vision, but here they've run into AOE and we just kill all of them. Yeah, nice. But you see, I'm 501, but <laughs> it's still a 827. Like, yeah. And this bot wave is infinitely crashing into our side, so I, it's, I don't know what to do, you know. Mid lane could push mid lane, but this is really like, it's like Crixie's thing, you know. They have two, we have two mages and none of them push mid lane. Anyways, I try to push this, but in hindsight, it's a pretty bad idea. 
Yeah, so two of them show up. I should have been on blue side, but eh, my team gets the blue side bungo. I'm ridiculously ahead, so you know, it's good to share the farm too. Anyways, uh, she sees I'm three levels above her, so she's not gonna try anything fancy. This person as well. Yeah. So here I complete my claves. She is going to fight. I should have gone forwards. I was not sure where Yina was. I saw her mid side, but there she is. So I didn't want to go for it. <coughs> Here I just <coughs> don't worry about it, man. Like I could be like saying, "Yeah, my team should have come," which they should have. We have the lead, and we should have vision on that side. They shouldn't be able to come through mid like that. But whatever. Look at them. Three little musketeers, man. We have no support, so yeah. Nice kill there. And I mean, I knew they were coming from mid, but I didn't care, right? But if you want to climb, then you should care. You should be doing what, like, you should be doing the right thing. Okay, so, so the game is, as you can kind of feel, it's not going that well anymore. I'm just farming, trying to farm well. We have four or five heroes that need farm, so it's going to be pretty interesting. <coughs> because the <coughs> because I'm ahead and a fight breaks out mid lane, I'll just take this dragon. You see, I do ridiculous damage already to minions, so I can just keep farming. Here I'm just like enough, I'll just take this mid tower so it goes down. A fight breaks out. I could have killed her I felt like, but if Joker ults me it's it's a big yikes, so yeah. Here another fight breaks out. This annoying Chogner is in my way again, so I kill him first. We pick up two or three kills, so I think all will be good. Get this blue buff. Again, our waves were not pushed, so can't get anything out of this. To pick up a random kill so we get this mid tower. And you see I've done nothing this game and I'm 7-1 somehow. So yeah. Probably farming 1k gold per minute as well. Just by not doing anything special. There's not much to comment, right? Because you see I'm just going through the, the through the motions. And uh, here I sit in this blue bush because I feel like someone was ganking our other ADC, but no one came. I do this because we have two ADCs, right? So it should go down quickly, like 50k HP. We have Ignis and two ADCs. <laughs> it just dies. So another fight breaks out, but remember because I took that opportunity to take this dragon, this elder dragon, it gives our entire team bonus AD and AP, so yeah, we finished. Here I mess up. I felt like I killed her. So you see, I didn't kill her there because I had, I bought the wrong item. So, as you may know, the pink bow is made of two big items, two small items, the blue thing and this red thing that's on my last slot. And I bought this, this one first, which cost 800 gold. If I bought the blue one, which cost 1000 gold, you see the enemy joker has it on her fourth slot. So if I had that, then I would have killed her before she killed me. 
even though I misplayed, I could have still killed her. So things like that really matter. You have to buy items in the right way, and you have to buy the right items. You see how, like, if I killed her, I could have probably taken Baron blue buff. But it's huge. That's why I get mad when people, like, post their dumb screenshots on, like, WeChat. Like, screenshot Andy, and they build wrongly. Of course, when you build wrongly, you're gonna lose the game. It matters so much. Anyways. It was, a, that's why I chose, like, I, I play, I went, like, 20 and 1 earlier. I use, I decided to use this. I thought this, like, recording was more, like, indicative of, like, you know, a typical game. So here, I, I mean, I don't know, we're just sitting in that bush, and they keep face-checking or trying to, and they just get poked out. I felt like if I went to stop the top laner split pushing, I would have died, so I didn't do it. I just took this. Someone else should go. <coughs> and I <coughs> I didn't really care. Just take this Baron. Yeah. He gets our inhib, oh well, but I get Baron, so I'm gonna look to finish this game. So he is pretty smart, he goes this way. And she's just so squishy because she used all her spells already. There I feel like I could have been a slightly more aggressive, but anyways. Here I go to finish for fun. She does so much damage, look at this. I went in there for fun, I was like, mm, I'm 12 and 3, I've got my pink item, let's do some 1v3. And I'm bored, but okay, if you're like, uh, if you're like looking to climb, don't do that. Here I question mark that guy because he's like my friend and you saw he was autoing the Chognar over the Joker, so I'm just like... <laughs> and then he says, I think in chat he says, why am I autoing? Why does it attack the fish? <laughs> Come on, dude. Like, the fish had higher HP. No, the fish had lower HP, and he was the nearest target, so there's no way. You had to click the hero icon to attack the ADC, so... Bad player, by the way. And he's in Masters, so... Yeah, scrub. Anyway, so the game is looking to finish soon. Like, even when you're behind as Violet, as long as you make it to her like 4 or 5 item power spike, like her pink bow, she's so broken, like she does so much damage. If you can make it to this point, even if you start behind, so I started ahead this game, but if you can make it to this point, it, it, she does so much damage. If you don't mess up the team fight, you pretty much can't lose. And she has decent wave clear, so yeah. Here I'm, I don't know, he was, he was smart, I didn't realize he could do that. Which, which for me, I feel like I'm gonna think about doing that when I play him, I usually don't, I just run around the map pushing, right? I might try to hide in a bush next time. <coughs> anyway, <coughs> anyways, the, everyone dies somehow, you know, I don't even know how, I wasn't even watching. But uh, yeah, the game is gonna end soon, and I feel like, like, there's some scenarios where you have to carry as a jungler. But if you get your team rich, which you can clearly see, our mid is not a bad player at all. If you can get him rich as well, then it's like dual queue. You know, you, he can help you win the game as well. So being a good jungler is not only about like carrying yourself having a lot of gold in controlling objectives it's also about like letting people get rich of course that works less in aov but if you don't always have to be like a toxic jungler who taxes people you know i didn't tax anyone this game either did i maybe i taxed spot lane a bit but that's the, his fault for not defending the wave right so i don't know this in Chinese, we have an expression the Mulan presses like 17 different buttons, and I press one, and she gets she outplays herself. <laughs> I don't know, dude. 
So this Chogner is being annoying again. I can't enter this fight because this goddamn Chogner is everywhere. <coughs> but anyways. We're about to end, I think. Here I'm just I'm just randomly like the the enemy jungler also messes up. I tried to do some outplaying, but yeah. You see like I will do like 29% damage this game. If you watch this video, it cl it's clear that I didn't do shit, right? I didn't do anything, man. Like, that's this is the minimum performance you have to play. And then if you want to climb faster and win, you have to play better than this. So this is the bare minimum. Anyways, sorry for the black screen. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And let me know what other videos you want to see. Peace out.